My task today is to try to repair a speaker off an iMac. And you can see that the cone itself has deteriorated over time and it's sort of turned into a, like a tarry sort of mixture really. Um, and on the back of the speaker there is a, another magnet that uh, attaches to the back of the actual speaker. Um, what I want to attempt today is to, I've got two new speakers, these two new speakers, and I've taken apart the old speaker, um, disregarded the, the cone, because you can see that it's just deteriorated, and I've prized off the other part of the cone, the other magnet. Now this magnet is pole against pole, so they're the same poles and of course they repulse each other. So when I try to assemble the new speaker, it's, it keeps on wanting to slide off to one side. So my solution to that has been to turn up a aluminium collar. That collar will fit over the top of the original speaker, but leave a small radius in the corner where the new speaker will locate and the actual contacts just about clear the aluminium and the, the contacts also have plastic sheaves over them. So that's my job today and I'm going to stick the back of the speaker onto the magnet with a, a ferrite glue which is like a, um, a two part type of glue. That's my task. So I should get back to you with the with the finished results. Thank you. I've glued the actual speaker to the back magnet and you can see that it looks very similar to to the one that's uh, original. I don't know what difference this will make to the sound, but I guess it makes some sort of a difference. But we shall find out. Okay, I've assembled the actual unit now and it's held together with a screw and I thought first of all the screw helped to keep the speaker actually in place but uh, looking at it closer I've discovered that on the other half there are uh, two upstands and then when the speaker's in place, these upstands keep the speaker pushed firmly against the um, front face of the um, enclosure, uh, which, which um, yeah, it does a good job. So replacing that back magnet really keeps it nice and firm and as it was designed.